Hi guys! In today's video, I'm going to be creating a very simple hair and makeup look. To get started, I primed my eyes using this Makeup Revolution eyeshadow primer and then used this black eyeliner from Avon to line the outer part of my eye. And then I smudged this eyeliner using a fluffy pencil brush. For eyeshadow, I'm using this Sephora Miniature Palette and first I'm going to be using this light brown color and I'm going to put that in my crease area and blending it using this fluffy blending brush. Then I'm going to darken my crease using this dark brown color and using a smaller blending brush. And just to mention, I really like this palette and the eyeshadows are really pigmented. And then I used this golden uh, sparkly color and popped it on my lid. Now I'm going to do a very thin eyeliner using this L'Oreal Intense Liquid Eyeliner. And for my lower lash line, I'm using brown eyeliner from Maybelline. Moving on to the face, I'm first going to prime my face using NYX Primer Oil and then I am going for a dewy look so I'm using Body Shop Radiant Illuminator and going to put that all over my face. For foundation, I'm going to be mixing in two foundations. The first one is L'Oreal Infallible Pro Glow Foundation in shade 206 and Maybelline Fit Me in 230. And then I'm going to buff it out using Real Techniques Foundation Brush. For concealer, I'm using Maybelline Fit Me Concealer in shade 25 and I'm going to blend it with Real Techniques Beauty Sponge. Next, I'm using this bronzer from Makeup Revolution Palette and I'm going to use this bronzer on the perimeter of my face to just warm it up. For blush, I'm mixing these two PG shades. And I'm using this highlighter from Wet n Wild in the shade Precious Petal. This lipstick is from Wet n Wild in 914C and this one is from Birds Bee in shade 801 Sandy Seas. And to fill in my brows, I'm using this brown pomade from Makeup Revolution Brow Kit. Then I use the same highlighter to highlight my brow bone and the inner corner and then time to curl the lashes and pop on some falsies. Then I use the same deeper brown color to smoke out my lower lash line. Now it's time for hair and I'm going to be doing Hollywood Waves hairstyle. Recently Priyanka Chopra wore this hairstyle to Golden Globes Awards 2020 and I'm going to try and recreate uh, it on my hair. So I'm going to start off by sectioning my hair and I'm going to be curling my hair using 1 inch curling wand. So I'm going to start curling my hair from the bottom and work my way up and I'm going to be curling like so. After curling a section of hair, grab it and pin it in place and this will help the curl to retain its shape for a long time. And I'm so sorry the footage here is horrible but I hope you'll get what I'm trying to say here. And again curl, a sec uh, curl another section of hair, pin it in place and leave it pinned until the end and we will take it all off in the end. And here I was being very lazy and gave up on pinning my hair and quickly just curled all my hair. And I also took off all the clips that I used in the beginning. Now grab sections of hair and comb it once from the top and once from the bottom to blend the curls. So I pinned the left side of my hair using two pins crisscrossing on one another and to set the front section of the hair I used a clip to hold it in place and sprayed it with Pantene High Hold Setting Spray. Let it sit for about 5 to 10 minutes and voila you're done. And this is the final look. Thank you so much for watching. I will see you in my next video. Take care to the end. Bye bye.